Hi, how are you doing? Uh, today is the first video that I've made in a week, which is not that much time, but it low key is because I used to post like every week three times. But the thing is, first off, haven't been reading. Second off, it's not the end of the month, so there's no wrap up. I've been doing a lot of tags, but they don't really get a lot of views because who really cares about tags anymore? Couldn't think of anything to discuss, but one thing that is exciting that is happening soon is BookCon. And BookCon is an event that happens in New York every year. Um, one year it did happen in Chicago, and I didn't go that year. That was in 2016. But anyway, in 2018, 19, it's happening in New York like it normally does. And it is at the Javits Center. And basically it's just a book expo where you go. There actually is a, a longer convention before that called Book Expo. Basically it's just a convention for people who love books. There are authors there, booktubers come, they have panels and autographing sessions and a whole bunch of stuff all book related and it's amazing and it's June 1st and June 2nd this year and I'm so excited to be attending. I begun, I'm going to go for two days and so it's literally next week. It's the 26th I think today and it's literally next week. This time next week I will be at BookCon. And it's kind of surreal. It kind of feels like I'm not even going, but I know I am. It's just like, it's kind of like a mild feeling right now. But anyway, I'm going to need to do a lot of stuff before I go. Not really a lot, a lot, but you know, I have stuff that I want in order that I want to get done and ready. So I'm going to be not really vlogging, but making a whole video out of it because I'm going to be preparing for BookCon today because I've been procrastinating for a while, but it's not really my fault. Stuff happened, whatever. So today I'm just going to be showing you some outfits that I'm going to be wearing there um, while I'm there and then um, also going to be packing and that is about it so and maybe some books I'll be bringing with me even though I didn't miss all the autographing sessions but uh yeah so we're gonna get uh, get started with this first off the first day is Saturday and I'm going to be cosplaying as Jesper Fahey, Fahey from Six of Crows. You have seen my my uh, Jesper costume before on this channel and if you have not I will insert some pictures because I'm not about to dress into it because it's ready to be packed. But I'm going to be cosplaying as him and I might uh, put a hat on too because I feel like it might be a nice touch and a lot of the fan art that I see he's wearing a hat. But anyway yeah and um, I hope people see me and walk up to me and they're like hey Jesper I really hope. You know I still haven't read Red Cookie Kingdom but that's just how it is. And also here are some outfits over here that I'm going to be trying out for you guys. Basically, I just kind of wanted to do like more of a vintage look. Um, I do love the 1940s and 1960s. All the really, really old time. Not really, really, really old. But like all the basically beginning of 1900 stuff. But since uh, the thrift store that I did go to to get a lot of my clothes for BookCon did not have stuff that old. We're just going for like a, a 90s, 80s type of look. So, without further ado, I'm just going to be like trying on the clothes and, well not trying on because I know how they fit, but showing you guys outfit choices that I might go with. I might not wear these, but I might. So, if you like one more, you can comment that if you want to. If not, just stay along for the ride. first outfit I did read online and I have it blocked in my phone now that it's going to be about 70-ish degrees in New York at the time of BookCon so I feel like this could work I can do I can pull this off without a jacket I think I don't know I know New York New York is an island and surrounded by water so it could be really cold because I know I live by the water where I live at and it's always cold if you go like downtown it's always cold so we'll see but this is the first one um it's a little bit vintage I mean I think it's a lot vintage. I really like it. I think it's cool. So, tell me what you think in the comments or don't, you know. This one um, is obviously more summery than the other one. And I think if I did have a nice jacket to wear with this, I probably would wear it. But because the only jacket I have is like a hoodie and it's, it's black and it's not, it would not go with this right. I think I probably will not be wearing this one. But I do like it and I want to show you guys. It's a little bit vintage. I mean, I tried to be more vintage, but they didn't have any jean shorts, so I can't really go for the look I really wanted to go to because I did have an entire research session when I looked up a whole bunch of outfits that people wore in the 70s, I mean the 80s and 90s that I wanted to kind of like recreate or whatever. So hopefully I didn't fail completely. 
Um, this is the last one that I have to show you because it's only two days, so I'm not gonna be having like a whole bunch of outfits. So we're gonna get to packing now. Try to keep the same outfit on because why change? Um, so I'm just gonna be packing the stuff that I probably think I'm gonna wear, which is not even this outfit. So that's why I still have it on. So I'm just gonna be basically time lapsing me packing the bare minimum stuff that I need right now, just so I don't forget anything that I do know that I want to. That took basically no time at all, and of course there's still room in here for books, any other items that I need, and yeah. I am probably low-key the lamest book on goer ever, just because uh I don't even know why. I'm actually not lame. Why did I just insult myself? But this is my hopefully carry-on suitcase. And it is low-key high key mid-key packed. So that was another part of this video. And the last one, I feel like I'll just tell you some stuff that I'm gonna be doing at BookCon or whatever. And um, I like to thank Diversify BookCon. You can go follow them on Twitter. They are part of the reason that I'm going because they had this campaign on Twitter where basically they had a whole bunch of POC book bloggers, booktubers, book bookstagrammers have uh, to basically submit their um, their names or whatever, their channels or their Instagrams to their forum or whatever and then they sent them tickets to BookCon. They bought the tickets and stuff, they, they raised money for it and they got them weekend tickets to BookCon plus some extra stuff that you're all going to see in the vlog that I do because of course I'm vlogging BookCon. What does that look like? But yes, I'm so excited to go. I had never been to New York and I decided to go for the first time. It's one of my favorite cities that I wanted to visit forever. So I'm going to have a blast and you guys are going to be with me. Um, I'm sorry for not posting a lot of content but um, my BookCon vlog is coming up soon. I'm probably going to have a May wrap up and then Next month is the Biblio Games, hosted by Little Wolf Reed and probably some other people that I'm not sure of because I've been pretty absent as far as that goes. But I'm definitely going to be participating in that. So I'll see you guys later with another video. Bye.